welcome to the cs true in this python tutorial i am going to show you that how to uh, fit a gaussian model on a scatter plot and obtain its uh, amplitude uh, its uh, um, mean and its uh, standard deviation value by fitting a package called astropy modeling on a scatter plot so let's do it so here you can see that uh, the orange uh, dots are your data points scatter data points and the blue uh, like the blue curve is the gaussian model line among the data points so we have to obtain its amplitude highest value the mean corresponding to the highest amplitude and its deviation from the mean point so let's do it okay so before uh, doing that i need to import some library so import import libraries so for that import numpy so import 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 uh, numpy as np so this will take care of your add plotlib Then import mat plot lib dot pi plot as plt. So this will uh, take care of your plotting. Right now, you can also import random module. So import random. So this will take care of your your, your random numbers, and then I will. Import from Astropy. So from Astropy, Astropy dot modeling, modeling import, modeling import models, uh, comma fitting right. The list. There should be astro pi. So this will like uh, used to fit Gaussian. Okay. Now data point. Okay. So create x y data. Points as Gaussian, right? So for that, I will define my x equal to say np dot a linear space, and I will uh, go from minus ten to minus ten to forty, ten to forty, and I will take fifty data points. Now I'll define my y as a Gaussian. So uh, define y as Gaussian function. Right. So you can define y equal to give some amplitude, initial amplitude, say ten or hundred. You can give it hundred into np dot exponential minus. And then you can say x minus five. So five is the mean initial mean, and you can give say hundred um, divided by six sigma is equal to sigma is equal to hundred, right? Now plot it simply. So just type here pretty dot a scatter and pass your x comma y and put here plt dot. So, so this will uh, show your simple plot, right? So here is your Gaussian, and what we do? Our objective is to fit a Gaussian um, uh, through these data points and obtain its uh, parameters. So for that, I will add some uh, noise in that uh, Gaussian. So for that, I have created a random module. So I will add here noise. So uh, np dot 
mp dot random dot rand int and I will add noise as one to twenty and equal to data points as x uh, data points right now plot it see how it appears you can see here are some uh, some deviation from there uh, like uh, mean position of the data points as earlier. is to now fit uh, Gaussian through these data points so for that I will now fit now fit Gaussian okay so for that I will uh, inside a in initialize a model so I will say G initial equal to uh, models uh, dot Gaussian dot uh, Gaussian and I will take a model as a 1D and function so see what factor it takes so it will there is some mistake there's some models now okay so just so what it takes so it takes your amplitude mean and standard deviation values so just you can give it so you give here uh, amplitude amplitude you can give as a uh, 1 then you can give mean as 0 uh, mean as 0 you can give any value you want and then you can give a standard deviation as 1 right what is mistake there should be mm, comma now we have initialize our model what is mistake? Standard deviation. There should be mean, not mean. Now, okay. Now I will I will initialize a fitter. So uh, fit underscore g equal to fitting dot I will call a function left uh, mark lsq of heater and I will give a function right so this will like use to fit uh, the data data points now I will do the actual fitting now do actual fitting so for that type here G equal to take your model take an xy value okay so I will your, you can give your model as uh, G right G int call it and pass your x and y data so you can pass your x and y data right now run it okay so see uh, what actually g is going to give you okay so you can see g has given these parameters okay so i will plot it these parameters along with that so for that now plot fitted curve as fitted gaussian curve fitted Gaussian curve so for that type here plt dot plot your x and then g g of x right run it so here you can see that you have fitted your uh, Gaussian to the plot right you can see here now uh, you can also make some changes uh, from this uh, say you want to go to 50 so this way so i'll keep it to keep it to as a 150 right so here you can see that and now we can also give now see the parameters okay so here you have parameters g 
so you have amplitude you have mean and you have deviation okay so you can see the mean is okay so here you got g these are the parameters right and then you can give a label to these plots so just call here label equal to data points and give here say label equal to Gaussian fitting and just simply give here plt dot legend right so and you can also give different color to these plots so you can give color equal to k so this way you can fit a Gaussian using astro pi to the hospital plot okay and you can also obtain its fitted parameters so your initial uh, value is this one 101 but you are like fitted parameters are have this value okay so you can write here g will give fitted parameters right so this way you can do it so i hope uh, in this tutorial we have uh, learned a very uh, beautiful concept in it in uh, data visualization that how to fit a question on a plot using astropy package in python so here's a quote i have input from libraries uh, numpy matplotlib random model and astropy model of fitting uh, defined x data defined where data is gaussian and plus some noise okay so you can uh, say here y equal to gaussian plus noise okay so be commented plus noise right after that i have uh, inside the model as a gaussian i am given some amplitude mean and deviations then i have inside the fitter and there i have actually do the fitting using uh, fitting and then i have plotted the uh, fitted model and i have shown here and here is the fitted parameters okay so thank you